This may just look like a few dogs at play, but it's much more. These two pups will soon be big bad wolves, gray wolves. Animals the folks at Bush Gardens say are misunderstood. But wolves are actually very, very timid animals. Wolves are actually very skittish. Um, they don't, they're what we call neophobic or they're afraid of new things. We do a lot of work with these pups to, to have them feel comfortable in situations like this. 13 News got up close and personal with Kaya and Bayo at the park this week. Right now, they're part of a pack of four. Boise and Mia, their surrogate mother, round out the pack. Yes, Mia is a dog. She takes on the role of pack leader, ensuring the pups remain submissive until they're transitioned into one of three mature wolf packs. So that when they're introduced to the adults later on down the road, uh, they have much, much higher likelihood of, of success, much less likelihood of being aggressive towards those adult wolves, which of course could put them in a very dangerous situation. Ultimately, these wolves will be part of Bush Gardens' animal ambassador team. But that gives us a chance to talk about the important role that wolves and all apex predators play in their natural environments, in their natural habitats, kind of keeping uh, the ecosystem in check. It also gives us an opportunity to, to talk to guests about things like the SeaWorld Bush Gardens Conservation Fund. Kaya and Bayo are adjusting just fine, bringing on curious onlookers. But Boise's still a little shy and will be introduced to the public once the zoological team here determines he's ready. You can check out Kaya, Bayo, Boise, and Mia here at Wolf Valley through Labor Day and then on weekends during Halloween. For 13 News in Williamsburg, I'm Vanessa Coria.